Down is sharp as attack. He's put him on the headshot angle. He's got Shush in support as well. Now, it's not ready for the Palace fight. That's Shush's responsibility. It's Jane that's jiggling. Perfect flash. Wow. Straight to the face from the Glock. Goosh. And on the way back is Flip. Knocks down one. Rotates in. Fame taking a duel and he wins them both with Flip by his side. He frags everyone. Three on the pistol to mow down the heroic defense. Bomb down. Round lost unless Yabby can get anything done. It takes him a full 12 bullets, but Norbert gone. Be hard pressed to do much more. No kit, got to find two more. Dancing around triple, dancing around the default. And that's the end of that flip for four. Straight out of the gate, the outsiders. A statement of intent. Anticipating a Molotov down his gullet. This is mad. Move. He might get going down in the back here. Kickit is coming back, and Shush uh -oh. is not predicting this whatsoever. Uh -oh. He's pivoting, but he should be a dead man walking. Kick it, kick it hasn't spotted him. Kick it hasn't spotted him. Shush turns around and is gonna get the kill. How's he pulled that off? Nuts, nuts from Shush to have such a proactive defense so early into the piece. That signature heroic. Norbert legged, knocks his kneecaps off. And he's not slowing down necessarily. Kadian will have time to reposition. Flashes, spray, Norbert, vicious to take down Shush. And don't forget, Kadian repositions down, catching that mid presence. They're all now Tetris side. Facing in towards CT. Will Heroic avoid him? Still a lot of time on that clock. It feels like it slows down on rounds like this. Abby, good for it. Kadian the same. Nothing for Nor, but that low HP here has gone for the round the world maneuver. There's a small opportunity if Yabby doesn't hit this clean. Yabby needs it, loses it. Norbert should go down. He's hit every shot. They do get it eventually. There was a threat. And considering he was the one that caught Flack early, it's impressive. So do we see more of those risky maneuvers trying to find these gaps, thread the needle? Oh, they're they're going to flash and fight. Four of them taking mid control and... No with flash. Complete success to flattened. Flip, fame, down. Norbert advancing. Very forward position on this, and he's found a gap. There's no one home. Bombs going down, courtesy of Jame, and they're making a round out of this with a two-man disadvantage. Heroic favored for the retake, but look at this. Norbert caught out, Tessa's aware. And it will just start to peter out. They'll activate when necessary. They do need to get their ass on towards that bomb. Jame already catches Yabby. That is impressive. Oh. This is a problem now, because Kick is still on the site, and he just needed one more frag. One more frag in the 2v5 could have been a very real. Look how little time was left. Well handled in the end. And currently yet to frag. Tessa. That changes. Cadian about to make a lot of impact on this rush. They're throwing bodies into the B site and Cadian's just swatting them away like pesky mosquitoes. Get out. Only one. Jame and his Kevlar vest going to do his Kevlar best. But we've got a fourth or rather a third. The B-bomb site was very light on earlier. It's just Tessus, but Cadian's here, but is he here in time? In the first shot, he spotted the cross, one down onto Fame. Another death for Fame. Five deaths, zero contributions. This time handed his ass by Cadian, and they cancel plans. A little less experience on this side of the site, especially on a grand final fight. Yabi dancing with Flit. He's been a very imposing presence. James trying to chip away further as well. Shush has not moved. Look at this. The restraint on him leads to a frag. Should be two. And that's the round locked in for Heroic. But you can see this is another example. Outsiders will make you work for everything. You cannot relax. Forward position. Yabby aware and now noted. It's Fame to activate. Down. That was his responsibility. But Fame with that hero AK does hero things. If he could just get another, Fame announces his presence in glory and bloodshed. Cadian tested on window. Tessa's tucks and turns tail. Actually dunks on fame. That's a big nade from the Dane. Or posted, and that smoke won't last forever. He has got that Tech 9 in order to facilitate any close combat he's required for. The Relic have really oh. strung out. Flip. Straight to the head of Shush, and this now falls apart for the Danish defense. There is an open plant. Knocks him off it. This isn't like any other game. This is your opportunity to win a major grand final and join the elite. It's our World Cup. This is the tippy top of our mountain right. This is every Counter-Strike player's dream. Account for Heroic, at least firing off the shot. No damage inflicted. Flit, just a bit of chip damage. Back of the box, down to half. Fame tries his luck on the same move, and they stack nade again. Heroic, draw blood with shrapnel alone. Down, can't extend oh. that lovely dink. Obscured view, but Fame still holds his nerve. And now Kadian for the finish. Oh, it cost him his life. That was a little arrogant.
goes for the finish. He was just so hungry for it. Didn't consider the game position. This is the info game again. A ramp, nobody. They've actually given up uh -oh, the gap to kick uh -oh. it, who is starting to come back around. Shush might get caught by a timing here in the two of these. They've had some awkward timing so far. Kick it's very aware. So is Jame, and this should be a panting right here. The A bomb site is open for business. Yabby on the oh, flank man. as well again. It He's flanks on flanks on flanks. Coming, flanking the flankers who flanked. Yabby, how has he got this gap? Both there, both oh, dead! Oh, oh, Yabby, impact! It looked like outsiders round now. The script flipped and only one more headshot required. Norbert catches flack. One to the head. He's sitting it, he's sitting it. He is holding it. Oh, and he doesn't, he doesn't expect it. Caught Tessa the blood. saves them. What a <laughs> round, Yabby and Tessas. With their powers combined, will make a fifth round reality. Oh, okay. Kick it on the crawl. Now, Shush will be exposed. Spotted. Kick it. Oh, Laser vision. Got a free headshot there. Shush caught out, but he does survive long enough for Stown at least to shut him down. Outsider still making a very imposing presence up the stairs. Nice angle through the smoke. One and done. Fame to trade. Two on two. Very high stakes game. And the bomb is being planted. The pot shot to bait Yabby to crawl. I don't think they got the info on the walk through. Timing good. Oh, Damage oh, oh. better. Straight through the triple box, getting Yabby a problem. They don't have a kit. There is one there you see on Shush's corpse. Actually one right in front of them. You can see that through the X-ray. Time-sensitive mission. Kit picks up. Oh, spots them both. Deep Eliminates plan. one. Fame holding his nerve in his first major. Never mind the grand final. He's lost him. He's completely lost him. Fame evaporates the invisible man. Clutching up for the outsiders <laughs> with pinpoint precision. That's nuts. You have to have impact. It shows as well, James. Clutch of the tournament so far. One of the many reasons they find themselves in this grand final. Now fame. Oh. Down, down. Another name we must mention as he forces the conversation. A double kill forward on mid. Norbert's his next victim. Stown with three and dips away. Bates into Tessess. And the whole squad just sent packing. One to go. James does hit the first. <laughs> right, that, 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 that's, a, that's a bit I of a gag. I would even a, laugh at that one, yeah. right? So uh, Stown could do it all, right? And in terms of like superstar ascension. Two through mid, flit and fame. Dastardly duo, coming for you. Cadian, gonna be swept through. Nice find from the leader. One and done. Fame still an issue. Shush, woof, meets his fate. Double out of his M4 still, and Fane did take a lot through that smoke. Up against the three of them. Tessus, if he can find it cleanly, does get spotted out by Jane. Relay of information. Fame is up close. The bait, the switch. They're not looking. Good react out of Tessus. Leaves it all on to Jane. One bullet, one kill. Smoke on the bomb. Can he really find all three? Just has to stop that defuse. Yabby looking the wrong way. One. As he looks to find another, it's caught out, well played, just enough time on that defuse. For a seventh, for Heroic, I'm nervous every time the man's in a clutch. This push from Tassas, if he keeps going through the B apartments, he may find the bomb before outsiders have committed. I love this. First shush, spoke his name, still gets one on the swing through. Tessas will find the bomb here. Yeah, that's big from Tessas, round defining. Knife out! Oh! He doesn't know, oh! and he lost his head, kick it, has saved Outsiders. Tessus. Where was he going, the bomb was there. I don't think he saw it. Cadian with him, James doesn't miss these. As soon as you cross into his line of fire, whoa! Gorgeous. From that orc, one orc for Cadian. What can you hit? Not the same and run on down. It is a one out half on the T side. Outstanding from the outside. It's a recovered half from Heroic. For the taking, look at this. This proactivity, this awareness of the gaps. He's already borrowed into bench as the smoke lands. James not ready. Okay. Stown delivers on the frag. How are you going to get back into this? Oh, Stown's going to keep pushing forward, taking the fight. Tessas has found fame. This is perfect. What a gorgeous pistol. But Norbert and Kicker aren't laughing. They Hedin's don't think on it's the pretty. Yabby's still coming. Yeah, he's miles away. He has to hit his first on it's the t default plan as well. He's got short to contend with. And he's already dealt with Kicker. A lovely tap out of that P250. Leaves Norbert. He's got the perfect retake package. Fully loaded. Smoke. Kick. Onto the bomb. Tickle it. Nervous. Cadian running in down. He's got to find that player on the bomb. Fakes it out. Still not getting that frag. Playing with them. He should have it on the knife. Missing it now. Cadian getting nervous. He has got it just in time. An extra 1,500 bucks as the Karambit sinks into the Kevlar vest of Norbert. All and right. a force by with two Fami. 
Could go wrong because there's a lot of bodies here from outsiders and fame is so deadly on that FAMAS. The FAMAS with two. Shush finally stops him before any more damage is done, but I'm afraid that will continue to echo They're through this in. round. They are trapped. Door locked with Norbert with the key. Now they can play this as they typically do. Kicker does go down to the flame. A war of attrition from Spray. And Norbert is starting to actually press the issue. Oh. Yes, is unawares again, just clotheslined with the hand cannon. A single bullet, lethal. And oh, James snapping to the head of Stown as well. Outsiders will make you work. And this second round, supposed to be a walk in the park. It's not, it's more like Jurassic Park. Snapping at you everywhere you go. Little Velociraptors, Flint and Jane will finish it. And that's a force by victory, that T-side pistol. So now Jame is a loose piece. He this gets to read this as he likes. Really interesting from Fame. You can see the passive start. This is the fight he was waiting for, and Stown does nothing. It's again Fame in the feed for two. He is good for the double, is Fame, but maybe Heroic can do something with what remains. Jame making it difficult. On to Jabby. And yeah, he's found all of the frags necessary. Cadian now with a touch of his tongue. A quick snap of the Deeg, a great shot. And eight seconds left, he'd have to bang him out now, and that will do. That will do nicely. Outsiders have humbled Heroic. 16 frags, the, the boy is back. He's got the most multi-kills in the server right now. Oh, and there might be a few more on the agenda. Here it comes, oh, oh. with four, just knocks Heroic for six. Oh, oh, oh. well, ah. yeah, sure, they're eco-kills, but that's going to feel good in the context of this game. Well time, Nade. Flit and him are working in unison very well. What a shot. It's straight through the smokes, down, down. And look at Fame. He's just not flustered. It's a good one back from Shush. Won't be expecting such an immediate trade because, yeah, there comes Norbert. Swings through the angle. Positioning brilliant from the outsiders. Looking like the better team. No one knows that Cadian has slipped through. This is interesting. Oh. Especially now. Kickert saves the day. Tessa's bomb, three to find, and Jame having absolutely none of it. Just hold it in that angle. You said already was posted up, expecting something fruity. Heroic come knock it. Jame opens the door. A lovely find onto Tessess. More required. Jame, the time lord. Just I can't find him. To destroy as they do. Oh, hit some shots. He's still on sight though. Five as they go for the bomb. <gasps> Bodyguarded by Yabby. Incredible resuscitation for the Danes. And now Kaden may have spotted a frag. Yabby delivers. Oh, they oh. will close. What a turnaround. Heroic down in the dumps, but they stand tall. Yabby had to get that kill. Well, he did, not when I expected it. So the rotation Bang. over. That is a massive shot Whoa. from Cadian. That is crazy. And the barrel, Pinocchio's nose, giving him away right there. <laughs> Poor Jame, and this is just a finish. Every shot coming their way. That is definitely going to get the boys fired up. And take a look. Everybody showing some emotion right here. That's from their last timeout, Chad. That is what it has created. The fallout, the reverberation. Or where Heroic are positioned. You can see Jame has actually put himself at the front of the pack. The spearhead of the assault cuts off Stown. Oh, where that came from. Yeah, and he's in time for this peak. Oh, Cadian out, orps one. Good whack from Flip. Multi-kill massacre in the underpass and kick it with three. Body's going to deal with that, but that is for 14. And this is kick it on the jump up. Gets himself up to the double digits with the rest of the team right there. So not a pressure moment, but some big kills and obviously some confidence boosting kills right here. If distraction is, well, thrown as it is towards the ramp side and shush, out, about, and oh, doesn't clear his corners. Damage onto Flit, info as well. Jame never caught out. Yabby meets his fate at the hands of Jame. Only three for Heroic, a three versus five once, yes, but Lightning, will it strike twice? Stown does with an opening. Trying to plant, hectic, good fight back. Stown onto Fame, Cadius back his turn, is kicking again, and only Stown, a lot of damage done. Three in the round, but outsiders, they're up to 15. This is their map pick, and they are showing us why this defense has been brutal. And this was after those two opening exchanges came in. It's a really, really good work from outsiders here. A decent attempt from Stown. You question what's possible if he had a couple more bullets in that 8K, but that's run dry. 
And the final buy from Heroic has as well. Rifle, sure, but Util, it's not existing. Who needs to make the play? Who's going to step up? Oh. Yami with a massive shot onto Flit there. That is special. Everyone is a real sharp individual. It's the reason they're in the grand final. But who can do it when it matters most? It seems Josh can too. Well, call it off, call it off. Outsiders, you don't have to get involved in this. And classically, they will give this one over. But how much damage do they want to inflict? Yeah. But they won't have that as a possibility on the other side of the server where Jane, he will retain his. Well, this is a nice pace change. Heroic now There's starting no to build themselves home. here. Norbert trying to get back in time, but they should be in. The smokes will land. He throws out his own. He's going to try his hand and a bit of a defense, a solo. Hold, oh, Norbert, big frag. Oh! Two! Out of Norbert! Shush and Stan will silence the initial response, but the cavalry still canters in. Flick goes wide. Bomb to be planted. Kick it to distract. Recovers a pistol and a rifle. Equipped now. A three on three. This is a brawl. And this is for all the marbles on Mirage. Quick back from Flick. Heroic tapping heads down. Still in Ushant with 20 HP. Goes down and only Cadian can save them. Kick it and Jame for the map. In this grand final, easy peasy, lemons are squeezed, it's Outsiders up on the first map. Heroic crumble. And it leads to a lot of interesting mid rounds. I'm going to be very intrigued to see how this plays out. Now, could this be fame on the jiggle, catching immediate flag, gooshed. Down to 3 HP on the Glock to USP. And oh god, Cadians works just as well. Long range, eliminates Flit, and they're coming in. No smoke, no mirrors, brute force. Straight through, charging, wrapping around the smoke, guiding one of them, kick it, does go down. Takes one with him, gap on that smoke. Shush is vulnerable, Norbert on the site, does have a kit, and they're not ready for him. Unaccounted for, back to turn, only the one body drop. Still three versus two. Favors heroic for this pistol. And especially now, Tessus has taken Jame out and it was Fame that got his head rocked and now knocking oh, off his stuff oh. is Tessus. Wow, that pistol round means an awful lot. And look at the captain there of heroic getting extremely fired up. This is twofold. Well, no rotation. Actually, Cadian's walking into this in connector. Yeah, I mean, no barrels betrayed him. Fame, oh, he's dodged back turn. Cadian caught out, but Yabby did open up the B site. So Flick called upon. Oh. Plucks, shush, on the leap. Repositioning to ensure they have a crossfire. Norbert's flanking again here. This is brilliant out of Outsiders. They've got him locked in. Oh. That's the finish. He sprays down one. A lot of damage onto Stown. His ears are ringing. His hands are shaking. And this round is surely the Outsiders. Stown takes him down. Bit of team damage. Three to find and Flip will finish. That's lovely. Implies his absence of knowledge as to where the body of the assault is coming from. Anyone can hit a spray here. Ten bullets left in the mag. Jane, good for the one. It's still Norman. Still hitting shots on that. Galil, nearly three. Tessas has got the better and got the third. A two on two. Flit rotates. And he's opting for bank side. Cadian's aware that's a possibility. Kick it loud. May draw Cadian's attention, and it has perfect execution. Tessus, no, 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 you cannot clutch up as well. Four frags, dancing with Kicker just in time, though. The Outsiders will rise. Cadian either has to take one of two choices there. I bait my teammate, I leave him when he's lonesome, or I need to, well, try and cover him off. And he went for the cover option here, maybe a little bit more selfish in nature, and they could have converted this round. But a great attempt from Tessus as we do get this back in the highlights. I don't have a name for it, but there is this kind of common wow. situation. Great Shot, right but there is this situation in counter-strike where by giving information by relaying information your players will react to it yeah it's norbert kick it all in position flits the one though to draw blood stout gone trying to run him down good on the glock shush one very light on options now and especially with a shot like that flit <laughs> massacres them a full ace as heroic just head in hands Housekeeping, making sure no short info can be found. Now, obviously, boosts are available, but not currently occupied. Norbert jumps in. Oh, wow. my God. Wow. Stout is straight <laughs> inhuman. Warning signs of what's to come. Heroic with a man advantage, but how long will that last? A miss out of Jame. Uncharacteristic kick it to be cleared. A perfect flash. It's Cadian that sets him up. Does that mark the round? Looks like it. Holds it on. A heroic round. Three for that T tally. This. Whoa. Whew. 
Bit too much hang time right there, Mr. Norberto. Yeah, didn't quite calculate his trajectory. Bang on the money. Shush as well. That was a perfect setup. You saw how, from Kickett's perspective, his counterplay was null. Is that deception? You're coming towards James Domain, oh. and he catches him out. Shush! Puts the leader on his ass. Clears the toilets. That's a big frag, a big scalp. Yabby, the one to charge in. Gets info. Does catch lead. Shush nearly dead. Careful. Norbert's coming. As outsiders have taken the site. Back and forth. The pendulum swings now, considering B, but it's getting awkward. Very awkward. They've got one smoke, Chad. What do you possibly build into the site that already outsiders have bolstered and fortified? Smoke heaven. Flitz already on his pillar. Kick it. Good for the frag. Stan will trade. Still a chance for these two Danes. Not anymore, because Flitz got another. Cadian on the floor. Rotate through. Stout. Definitely robotic. He can tap some heads, but he's lost a lot of life and fame crawling through. Plays it to perfection. Outside is five. Handling it there. And heroic. Okay, Kicker, what's he got for us? He's safe from the flash and a panic smoke to at least divide. Trading territory. And he conquer. Good flash again. Forces him into the pit. Flitz, good frag back. Good on Gabby. Just to tech nine. All he needs, but Flitz, such a problem. He is doing so much work for the outsiders. Nearly takes down oh. as well. Attacked to the side of the skull as James gone. And this round is up for debate. Kadian on to Norbert. What a one and fame. Keeps outsiders in it. What was that? Wow, so much trading there, and the bomb didn't go down at all. That actually really stings for Heroic. We want to keep the pressure on because right now outsiders aren't building that economy, but this is how Fame just closes out, and it's easy. It's easy for him to close that out because the kills happen so fast. There's no mind games. Very, very Everyone's well here, Alex. Molotov. And yeah, Everybody, all five 10. Versus five, deathmatch. Tess has to try and break the silence and breaks the neck of Norbert. Need more. Fame still on long. Molly won't last forever. Big fight to be had. It's a massacre. Heroic running out of options. It's Flit again with the double. And it's Fame for the finish. The flourish. One back from Yavi, but it is one way traffic. Fame and Flit all five. Four players on B and aggression in the monster tunnel. I can't. Can we talk about Kick it? He's got Flit behind him. The nose flash ahead. Jame already makes down dead. Yavi. Puts his name in the feed, they need more. Bloodshed, Tessus puts two on the floor. It's not oh! a guarantee when Norbert rains down Terra from above. Nine seconds, Kadian will try his luck at a plant. Fame from short side, he's safe from it. Can he come up clutch when he needs to? The answer, a resounding no, it's Norbert. Three. Yeah. This is the supportive element, right? We're talking about these individuals in the team. Fame, Flit, he'll kick it with the experience. Jame on the AWP. Well, there's the opener. Another one. Keep adding that to the stat line when Jame gets the opener and the conversion. But Norbert happens. <laughs> that is massive from heaven. And at that point, what are you meant to do? You think you're dealing with so many bodies. But I said it. Once you're getting through, you think you get some respite. You're getting none. Outsiders. Prioritizing monster. Oh, my God, what? Flit. You can't be getting two of those. <gasps> Yabby, what a gap. What a gap. Incredible presence of mind from Yabby to enter the site just as he knows the wall bank's being taken. If he could only get Flit, we'd have a site. We'd have a round tapping away, dancing with him. Light on bullets. Flit chips further away at him. He's very resilient on this site. And the rookie going elsewhere. Oh, my Lord. James going to have a freebie onto Tessus. And the rest just falling into place for this defense. Look at their health. 40 HP between the two. Nade, careful. Oh. Down, evades it. Down on eight HP. Jame can catch Cadian right here. Yeah. Oh, a bad spray. Another round. Cadian lets it go. Look at the aim from both of these teams right now. Yabby, it is building right now. Hey, hold up. It's not building. It is here. This is Heroic's opportunity. They've made it to the quarterfinal of the Major, the semi-final of the Major. This is their first grand final, and they're the ones under pressure now. Outside is playing without an issue. It takes pressure to form a diamond, and Flit and Fame shining bright on the grand final stage. This has to work. It's down, crawls through the smoke. Norbert attends to it exactly as he needs to. Jame is living in Cadian's head rent-free. Oh, and just a perfect <laughs> frag. You have been betrayed by the legs under the smoke. This is falling so perfectly into place. Death by a thousand paper cuts right now. Every single one of these rounds. Heroic, it seemed close. The score was six to three. The game still seemed close. But now, it feels grim. So aware. Any trick, they're aware. It needs individual brilliance. It needs one of these two to step up. Otherwise, it's going to read 12, and it's the same Groundhog Day on overpass. Yep, Norbert. 
on it. Shush, one, half health, problems on the swing. Jane will secure it. And still stone-faced, they're so close to realizing the dream of a major trophy. If there's nothing, cut the noise, charging in, no resistance. Tessa's sandbags, Jame opens the door, and it's Yabby, good on to fame. Takes down a heavy head, big one out of Tessa's. Caught on the reload, deleted by Flit. Back into the site, looking to recover. Outsiders, looking to throw a heavy blow to Heroic with that bomb plant. Shush, good on it, now swings through. Flit is out as well, only Norbert and gone. Heroic recover. It must win pistol under the belt, step one. He can sweep through toilets if they try and fake him out. This cat and mouse game. Sound, one here. Yeah, the smoke gap. He's not going to be ready for this. Elevated angle. Oh, and a good one from Norbert. Levels us into a four on four. Jay making decisions. Tessa's still around from behind. Could do damage. 35. As that bomb goes down. He's not clearing it. Neither of them. No, but from behind, he's let his shot go. Only the one from Tessus. Three on three, hard to break through. Maybe a bouncy SMG. Yeah, exactly. Oh! Shush! Breaks into the site. A, a little bit of hope. And it's smashed by Flit. Yabby trying to hold his nerve. There is time, but a 10 second defuse. The kit's forward of it. Does retrieve it. James Wise will jump for the info. Gets it safely now as he looks. And Yabby tries to play the game. James confirms. Fakes it out. <laughs> and takes the round. Outsiders are up to 13 at the hands of James in Rio. I want to see that one again. Like the details in a round like that. Tessa is getting circumvented there, but it's split with this double here on the Shush and Kadian. Shush buys in the space with the SMG, but you see his body go flying as Flit flings them away. And James, just the poise, understanding the time is his best friend. Oh, so beautifully played. You just can't do anything. Yabi, outplayed. It is Jane that goes looking. He will investigate the state of play. Kick it doing the same. Here they come. Flash is good. Frag so good. Need Yabby for more. Already on the floor. Stand one back. Trying to hold on. Bomb dropping back. There's so much time for this. Jane just sprung into action. Oh, He's dear. taking all this space. Everybody from Heroic responded to this. Norbert out. He is in the clear. Fame just has to him. hold them here. Playing with his food. Fame catches him on the mantle. Heroic's hopes and dreams falling by the wayside. Kadian next victim. Fame 17 3 in the round. Stone dead. Oh dear. Outsiders are inside their heads. Grab them out of, out of the depths right here. That there's no right option. Just sit back, wait for the push, and absolutely murder them. Fame with two more. He is making a name for himself. Fame and Flit. Quite the duo. A duo, I believe, we might be talking about for some time to come. And could very shortly be major champions. Fame and Flit. Yeah, a bit of an FU right now to Heroic here. On the Woo. double digs down. Yeah, he'd need a lot more of that. And James, the contingency. Poor old Shush, a USP. And they know where you are. 15 is coming by virtue of the nade. It's James. Bowls him out. Just to go to overtime. But this brotherhood of Heroic, they have battled through with the us versus the world mentality time and time again. In the public eye, this team, they have been ripped to shreds and they have done their best. Just to establish that elevated angle on Jail. But Kick is just been trying to walk through. He's caught them out. One down. Jabby needs to hold on for his life, for his major life. But down goes Kadian as well. It's Flit. Takes another giant leap towards that trophy. Yabby and Stown quaking in their boots. He needs these. He's a double. They're too good. They're way too good. Heroic. Shattered. Nothing to say on this second map of play. And Tessa's tasked with an impossible one. Outsiders have been perfect. And in Rio de Janeiro, Intel Extreme Masters 2022. He tries his luck. With every passing second of that bomb, the outsiders prepare to start the celebration. Finally, outsiders. Six years, Dastan and Jane been chasing this dream. They got the right pieces, and now they got a piece for the trophy cabinet. Their fifth major appearance.
kick it. Dastan, James, that core has been here before, but they felt the taste of defeat. And this time, the search for firepower fled a premium example. But Fame, Norbert, James, and Kicket united as outsiders and crowned your champions of IEM Rio 2022.